Hello, this is Pamela, and you are on Pamela's Adoring Crochet. I'd like to say welcome to my channel. And I'd like to say thank you to everyone that has supported me this year, and thank you to all of my new supporters and all of my new subscribers, and thank you to all of my subscribers that have been with me since day one. I appreciate you guys so much. Well, today I am drinking out of, let's see, it says, with Jesus in her heart and a crochet hook in her hand, she is unstoppable. And I'd like to say thank you for this. Um, I really appreciate this. I received this earlier this year and um, is, of course, one of my favorite cups. So I am drinking French vanilla coffee this morning. No, wait a minute. I'm sorry. Hazelnut coffee this morning. I just recently ran out of the French vanilla. So I'm on to the hazelnut and I really like the hazelnut too. First sip of the day. Mm, amazing. Okay, let's go ahead and get started in today's video. Okay, so I received this card. This is from Annette. Thank you, Annette. She has a YouTube channel called Pastel Dreams, and um, go check out her channel. I just want to say thank you so much. That is a beautiful card, and look what she made. Isn't this just beautiful? I just love it. It's gorgeous. Thank you so much for making that. I assume you must have starched this or something to make it stiff like this, but this is really cool. <laughs> so thank you so much for that okay so the next thing that i want to show you guys is you know the crochet world magazine this is the february 2023 edition you guys that subscribe to crochet world you have your copy or you should have your copy already and for the guys that you guys that are waiting for it to come on the newsstand um it should be i was told it would come out in december but every time i check they still have the December issue instead of the February issue. So I guess maybe um, it will be January before it comes out because they always come out before, you know, th that actual month. So like December has been out for a little bit. So anyway, there we go. It should be out whenever they put it out because <laughs> I have no idea. But I know I'm pretty sure it'll be before February if you're waiting on it to come in the store. So I just want to show you, there's the berry wrap right there. That's the famous berry wrap. But the reason I'm showing this to you guys again is because I have, oh wow, look at this. I don't mean to get sidetracked, but look at that. Now that's cool. Yay! <laughs> uh, let's see who designed that one. Rena V. Stevens. Great job, Rena. Yeah, I like that. Hmm. Could be another blanket for me, right guys? Um, let's see, I'm on page 62, but the reason I wanted to bring this up again is because I have a special lady who has been making, um, this, made two of these berry wraps already, and I'm so proud of her, but there it is, right there, page 62, Crochet World, February 2023 edition, yay. <laughs> So let me show you uh, two pictures that Patsy um, made already. She's already made two of these. Let me slide over so I can put the picture right there. <laughs> so let me go ahead and show you two. I'm going to pop up two pictures of Patsy's berry wrap that she made. And um, she just did a wonderful job. And Patsy, I'm so glad you love this pattern and that you're excited to work my pattern that's in this magazine. I appreciate that very much. So if you... Um, have made this or you're going to make this I do have a Facebook group page and you can post your picture of the berry wrap and I would love to showcase it on one of my videos for any of you that make the berry wrap oh and I forgot to mention when you open the magazine up in the contents I made the first page right there <laughs> so I'm super excited about that Okay, so let's go ahead and move on. I'll tell you what I'm working um, on right now. Do you remember I told you in yesterday's video that I went to my friend Nana's house uh, on Christmas? Well, her and her daughter, um, as a thank you gift, I'm going to make them a pair of slippers. So I'm still waiting on Nana's older daughter to get back with me on the daughter that still lives with her mom, Faith, to find out what size and what her favorite color is. But I will show you what I've got started on I'm Nina's. I'm using an eye hook that's a 5.5 millimeter crochet hook. 
this is my pattern and so i will i have a tutorial and i have a pdf pattern on etsy so i will leave both those links below but this is what i've got done so far actually <laughs> two of them and i'm fixing to start on the heel that's the part i'm on right now and i'm thinking i'm going to go ahead and do the heel the same color right here and then maybe the cuff that goes around the ankle I'm undecided if I want it purple as well or if I want it that lavender color. But her favorite color is purple, so that's why I'm doing this in purple. And it's so pretty. I can't wait to give these to you. So these are going to be thank you gifts for having me over on Christmas Day with their family. So the yarn I'm using is Big Twist by you. And it's 100% acrylic. And this color is soft purple. And you guys know I buy this at Joann's. And then this other Big Twist, it's called Grape. 100% acrylic. So yeah, those are the two colors I decided to combine together to make these slippers. Well, I guess I could show this off. I forgot all about this. This is the essential sweater that I designed earlier this year and it does have pockets. I actually forgot that I had made this, believe it or not, because there's been so much going on that um, it kind of came back to my attention when I noticed I was starting to have a lot of sales on Etsy for the pattern for this. And I was like, oh man, I forgot about my essential sweater. Um, so yeah, I thought I'd wear this today. This is warm, it's cozy. It is probably one of my favorite sweater cardigans or whatever that I have made. The only thing is it's a little big right now. So uh, that just means I have to make another one. <laughs> but at least it's nice, room, uh, big and cozy because I did make it. A little on the big side when I did make it because I wanted to be able to just kind of wrap up in it and so that's why it is a little big but yeah I just love these pockets on here so let's go ahead and see what else I have for you guys okay so this is the Annie's kit I used um, a 5.5 millimeter crochet hook for that this is the Christmas candy sampler afghan this was sponsored by Annie's um, they sent this to me every month to be able to work this for you guys and show it off to you guys so that um, you can see what this kit is all about. It was 10 of these plus the border. So 11 kits total that you get. And I went just, you know, you guys know that I'm more on the loose type of a crocheter instead of a tight crocheter. Um, so for me to have this much yarn left, that's a lot of yarn. I believe this is the only one that's got two skeins in it. The rest of these in here all have three skeins of yarn. I have a lot of yarn left. So I really was excited about that. <laughs> hey guys, here it is. Um, I will show a little clip real quick. Wasn't it beautiful? Here we go. This is it. So I love this. I know I'm a little late, a little bit after Christmas, but I don't care. This thing is super nice, super soft, super warm. I mean, it is just a bomb. I love this. Thank you so much, Eddie's, for sponsoring this. I had a blast uh, crocheting this, putting this together. It was just amazing. I learned so many stitches. Look at that. Look at this, guys. All these different stitches. And I learned this. I watched the tutorials that they have because they have the uh, left-handed and right-handed tutorials. I watched all of those. I mean, it's just amazing. Look at that. Yeah, it was a nice learning experience. And, oh yeah, see, the it actually goes this way because that's Christmas trees right there. This right here was probably one of my favorites right there. I had a lot of favorites though, but that has to be one of them, I'd say. But so was this. I don't know. It was it was just all so much. It was just so cool. Um, yeah. <laughs> all right, guys, I will leave a link below if you're interested in this kit. I will leave um, an affiliate link below for you guys to click on and uh, check out they have this in like maybe four or five other 
colors, uh, colorways, whatever, so that you can have like the Christmas, you can have fall, you can have summer, you can have like one for like the beach type, you know, it's, they, they've got them in quite a few different array of colors or whatever, but basically the same design, just different colors. So yeah. Anyway, so go check that out. All right, guys, let's go ahead and do our 365 days of prayer. Fruitful and fulfilled. Be careful how you walk, not as unwise men, but as wise, making the most of your time because the days are evil. Ephesians 5, 15, and 16. God of my days, all the wisdom that I'm looking for is found in you. You know how consciously I look for advice so I may live a good and fulfilling life. Laying everything else down in this moment, I come to you asking for your higher wisdom to flood my heart and mind. As I look into your word, I see that your ways are different than the world's customs. Don't let me be fooled by empty rules that seem to bring order but really bring uniformity without unity. Submitting myself to you, I don't need to fear the wasting of my days. May the fruit of my life reflect the fruit of your spirit. May the product of my time reveal the character of your life and mine. Whether I am running a corporation or playing with a child, if I am doing it with love, the fruit will testify to this. Let me be filled with your revelation today that sets my hope on your higher way. How are you using your time? And I think that is something that we should all be conscious about is our time. That was just great. And I'm so glad you guys like that as much as I like it. Well, guys, that's all that I have for this video. Tomorrow is Whip Caddy Wednesday. That means um, you need to start emailing me or putting your carts in the Facebook group page. And I noticed that someone got a brand new cart for Christmas, and I'm so tickled for you. Uh, it was very exciting when I saw that. All right, guys, that's all that I have for this video. Just remember to live life, have fun, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye. Thanks for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe.